Okay, not handling any really big issues here other than is there life after death? A study reveals that near-death experiences are not hallucinations. Okay, this could get interesting. That in a report at Study Finds, so be sure to like and subscribe below for the latest. Now, if I had the answer to this one, I would probably be independently wealthy or the good Lord himself. And trust me, I'm neither. (laughs) I had to tell you that. It's a question people have been asking throughout time, and the answer is still a mystery. Now, a new study exploring what people experience when they're close to death has come to one important conclusion. Near-death experiences are a real thing, even if we can't explain them. Kind of like Madonna's latest duck face selfie, am I right? (laughs) Countless people have claimed that their life flashed before their eyes or that they actually left their body and traveled somewhere else while close to death. Critics have called these experiences hallucinations or illusions, but researchers from NYU Grossman School of Medicine say something else is actually happening. A team of researchers from several medical disciplines, including neurosciences, critical care, psychiatry, psychology, social sciences, and humanities, have come up with a number of conclusions after reviewing unexplained lucid episodes which involved a heightened state of consciousness. So, really trying to find out what exactly a near-death experience is. The main finding is that these events don't have much in common with the experiences someone has if they're hallucinating or using a psychedelic drug. Instead, people who have a near-death experience typically report five different events taking place. A separation from their body with a heightened, vast sense of consciousness and recognition that they're dying, or they travel to a different location. Some have said they have a meaningful or purposeful review of their life involving critical analysis of all their past actions. Basically, their life flashes before their eyes. Some say they feel they're going to a place that feels like home, and the feeling of returning back to life is the fifth. Researchers note that the near-death experience usually triggers a positive and long-term psychological transformation in the person. The team notes that people who had negative and distressing experiences while near death did not experience these kinds of events. The team also found it turns out that scientists can actually see physical changes taking place in the brain when someone is close to death. Researchers found the presence of gamma activity and electrical spikes when people are technically dying. This is typically a sign of a heightened state of consciousness when scientists measure it using an EEG or electroencephalograph. The findings further back up the claims from people who say they left their body while dying. Study authors note that advances in medicine over the last century have brought back countless people from death's door. Lead author Sam Perina said, quote, The advent of cardiopulmonary resuscitation, or CPR, showed us that death is not an absolute state. Rather, it's a process that could potentially be reversed in some people after it has been started. Perina continued, What has enabled the scientific study of death is that brain cells do not become irreversibly damaged within minutes of oxygen deprivation when the heart stops. Instead, they die over hours of time. This is allowing scientists to objectively study the physiological and mental events that occur in relation to death. Study authors conclude that neither physiological nor cognitive processes completely end at the moment of death. While prior reports haven't been able to prove what people are saying about their near-death experiences, the new report finds it's also impossible to disprove what they're saying as well. So, while I don't have the answer, it seems people are taking the question seriously, and each time we seem to get another nugget of info. I have faith that one day we'll all eventually find out. We have more info on this and other studies at our website. Just click on the link in the description below and head to studyfinds.com.